Happy Friday, DR. I'm Tom Kimball. I'm Alex Souza. And this is DR News. Here's this week's High Five Club recipients with Trenton Saliba. Hey DR, I'm Trent Saliba bringing you this week's High Five Club recipients. Nathan Kowalski is enrolled in multiple AP and Honors courses while being a member of National Honor Society. He has played DR football for four years. Nate plans to attend a four-year university to study engineering. Mia Rogers is enrolled in several AP and Honors courses, captain of the winter and spring track team, National Honor Society member, and also a member of student government. She plans to attend a four-year university to study computer science. If you see them in the hallway, be sure to give them a high five. Who's that teacher? Next up, we have world news with Scott George. Hello, Drea. I'm Scott George. And I'm Tom Kimball. Welcome to World News. After a huge and lengthy legal battle fought by developers, Istanbul has decided to destroy three skyscrapers to preserve the city's skyline. Well, Disney finally released its trailer for Star Wars. What I really want to know is, why is a soccer ball in the trailer? There's no soccer ball in the Star Wars universe. <laughs> Once again, I'm Scott. And I'm Tom. Back to the studio. Hey students, missing supplies? Well, look no further. Come on down to the Crossroads School Store. We got t-shirts, hats, agendas, pencils, beverages, and more. The store is located in the Dighton Foyer in room 219, open every morning before the first bell. Crossroads, where Falcon Pride comes alive. Last week was Spirit Week. Here's a recap. Hello, DR. Here's this past week's Spirit Rallies. Have a great weekend, DR. I'm Alec. And I'm Evan, signing off. This week, Will and Matt went around asking students about the new Star Wars trailer. Happy non-specific winter holiday, DR. My name is Will Baresi. And I'm Matt Ricker. And this week, we went around and asked people about the new Star Wars trailer. I liked it. I'm confused at why R2-D2 is a soccer ball. What'd you think of the new Star Wars trailer? Hey, it's Star Wars. Uh, is that the one with Logie? Uh, you mean Loki, and Loki is from the Avengers. We're talking about Star Wars. Star Wars is the one with Spock. No, no, that's with Captain Picard. Will you please get your generations correct? I thought Spider-Man was in it. <laughs> This week, Corey and Jordan interviewed the Dean of Activities. How are you today, Mr. Kelly? I'm doing great, Jordan. How are you? Doing pretty good. Awesome. So the question I have for you today is, you've been Dean for about 60 days now. What are your plans for the future? There's so many ideas that I have for the school. We've got a lot of things planned um, going forward. You might have seen the new Falcon sign down at the football field. Many exciting things happening here. This job, the way it's set up, is for me to come in and change the way kids feel about being here at Dyer Mill High School. So any of you that are out there that would wa want to come down to my office in the athletic department, you've got an idea, you've got a notion, you've got a way of maybe uh, making life a little bit better for all of the kids here in Dyer Mill High School. That's really my job as Dean of Activities and Athletics. We're pumped, as you can probably tell. Thanks for being here today, Mr. Kelly. All right, DR, now back to the studio. Thank you. Lastly, we have a rant with who else but Ben. And now, to end the news, here is Ben. I recently bought an answering machine for my house phone, and I set it all up like it said to do in the instructions, and then I asked it, hey answering machine, do you like my new shirt? And then it just sat there. 
Then I thought, hmm, maybe I'll ask it a simpler question. Hey, answering machine, will I ever find love? And then it just sat there. I spent all my money on this box that's just sitting there doing nothing. You have one job to answer my questions, and you can't even do that. <sighs> Is this answering machine trying to tell me something? Thank you, Ben, for your pointless points. That's it for this week's edition of DR News. I'm Tom Kimball. And I'm Alex Souza. Have a nice weekend.